All right, you guys, what is going on? Welcome back to another video. Today's video, I'm extremely excited about. I really am. We're going to get back into some rugby. Rugby is my game. <laughs> it is. That's the game that I've played my entire life. Recently, I've been getting into football, as you guys know, but rugby, you know, still holds that place in my heart, and it always will. And before I start, I need to give a shout out to my man. Well, I actually don't know his first name, but he's got a reaction channel called the Matthews fan and I, I don't know if it's all reactions but he you know he does all sorts of stuff anyways he started doing reactions to rugby players or to rugby games as an NFL fan okay so that's why I came across his channel because he started copying my title <laughs> but doing it on the other way around anyway I've got to give him credit he stopped doing that he's called it my reaction now and that's given me a bit of inspiration to to, to most probably change my name of my reactions to, from rugby player reacts to either Jake's reactions or Jacob's reactions or my reactions. Let me know what you guys think about that. But this morning, <laughs> I, knew this, I knew this game was being played. Canterbury versus Auckland. The Matthews fam has already done a reaction to it. He's, he's fucking on the ball, man, this guy. He's on the ball. He wants to grow his channel. He's doing well. He's got a nice setup. So I want to say, if any of you guys want to support him, go and support his channel. Let him know on the, on the latest video. Let him know on the Auckland versus Canterbury video that uh, you know you, that you've come over from my channel or whatever anyways I want to watch this game this guy in America has watched it already and I haven't okay Canterbury is where I'm from Canterbury New Zealand so we've got the final of the New Zealand National Provincial Championship which is a national competition played between 10 teams I think they call it the ITM Cup now the ITM Cup and ITM is like a, a Bunnings warehouse. It's like a big industrial sort of timber, you know, nuts and bolts, that sort of thing. That's just the sponsor. So it's called ITM Cup. Canterbury, my hometown, okay, all of my childhood rugby heroes play for Canterbury. They have been, they have won it, I think, the last six or seven years in a row. Now that doesn't happen by chance, okay. Canterbury rugby, if you want to follow a team, a, a clinical, structured team, that's been at the top of their game for over 20 years. Follow Canterbury in the ITM Cup or the Canterbury Crusaders in the Super Rugby. That's all I've got to say. But without further ado, it's time for me to watch my first ITM Cup game of the year. And it's the final. <laughs> so what better way, what, you know, what better time to start? Let's do this. Let's look it up. The quicker you're here, the faster you go. That's why where I come from the only thing we know is um, 2018 ITM Cup Final. Now I don't know how many of these players I'm still going to recognise. If I do recognise some, I'm doing well. Like, I'm not even going to lie. So, uh, where are we here? Um, Can Canterbury vs Auckland. Premiership Final Highlights, there we go. And if we go to... <laughs> The Matthews fam. <laughs> Lamar. There he is. My man. See, look. An hour ago. Premiership final. Auckland versus Canterbury. My reaction. <sighs> I've got to give you credit. I've got to give you credit. But I can't watch your reaction before I do my own. I'm sorry. It's my turn. Eden Park. The All Blacks were un well, I think they're still unbeaten at Eden Park for like the last 20 years. It's in Auckland. Just let me look up uh, ITM Cup winners. Let me have a look here. I just want to make sure I was right about Canterbury. Here we go. 2008 Canterbury, 2009 Canterbury, 10 Canterbury, 11 Canterbury, 12 Canterbury, 13 Canterbury, 14 Taranaki, 15 Canterbury, 16 Canterbury, 17 Canterbury, oh! I just saw the fucking results! Shit! But I don't know the score. Burley! Burley. With the burst. Now Bridge gets it wide, and McInnie 
I was going to say, he shouldn't have scored. Nice pass, but no space. And the penalty's good. Who the fuck is that? <laughs> See? I don't even know him. The big maul by Canterbury. Oh, they're going to have to check that one. Penalty try. They must have collapsed it. Auckland. Offside. So, as the two groups of forwards were pushing up against each other, it's called a maul. Okay, Canterbury were going like this. They want to get over the try line. Auckland coming back the other way. There's certain rules as to where the Auckland players and the Canterbury players can actually enter that ruck. They need to come around the back. Okay, and I think this guy, Iwani, came in from the side to try and, you know, stop Canterbury. Um, and that's why he was sent off. And it was a penalty try. So they scored a try, they got five points, they got the kick, now they're at seven. And this guy is, is in the bin for ten minutes. So Auckland have 14 players and Canterbury have 15. Oh! Spies the gap! He's got the pace! He's not big, is he? That's just hitting a line at pace, man. Fuck, get him! Oh shit. Oh, that's nice. I want to see where that inside player started coming up. There he is. There he is, right there. It's good. I don't know if he expected him to be there or not, but a nice try. Second half, 20 to 7. Boomer! With the boomer downfield. And he's going to take a quick throw. Let's go, Auckland. Show us what you got. Where are you going? Nowhere. <laughs> Dangerous tackle. And again, oh! Nah, back for the penalty. Another yellow card. So now Canterbury's got 14. Confident in what he saw. Well, they lost one for 10 minutes. It's Canterbury who will lose Billy Harmon to the sideline. Billy Harmon. No idea. Billy Harmon. No idea. Billy Harmon. 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 And the rain doesn't make it easy, man. <laughs> it does not make it easy to play. It means passes are shorter. You know, there's more penalties, there's more knock-ons, there's more stoppages. Personally, if I'm watching a game of rugby, I like crystal clear blue sky. Perfect cut grass, you know. 20, 25 degrees Celsius. The ball is going to fly through the air. There's going to be no handling errors. It's going to be a nice running game of rugby. Anyways. So the kick from Brett Cameron is a good one. And Canterbury... Fucking hell, it's soaking. So Drummond away oh. for Cameron. Found a little bit of space in behind. But trying to... See? Oh, he's down again. And he's isolated. Get in there, Canterbury. Get the ball. Auckland were isolated. Twenty-six 
defense holding well. Rayasi's got himself in the bag. Now they go wide. Oh no. Bang off the right and he's through. Easy. Bang. See ya. Twenty phases. Holy shit. See they said twenty phases, alright? That means that Auckland each phase is a tackle, okay? So the player gets tackled, they have to release, release the ball, your players blow over the top, they retain the ball, the halfback comes along and passes it out again. Each one of those tackles is a phase. In rugby, you just keep going until someone makes a mistake or the ball's turned over. So Canterbury defended 20 times in a row before that, before that try was made. So that means that they're tired, you know. Tackles are going to start falling off. If the, ball, if the ball carrier, Auckland in that case, keeps the ball for long enough, they're bound to break through eventually. And that's, that's the thing about rugby. Cardio, man. Cardio, consistency. It's a hard game. Four on three, and it's a try. See? I knew it was going to happen. Look, guys. You can see it. You can see it. Right there. Okay, you got one off the back. Two, three, four. Against this guy who's going to break off the scrum. Two and three. So it's a simple pass, 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 and he's in. Pitch, pitch, pitch. Lateral, 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 and he's in. Now, why could you not do that off of a uh, off of a scrimmage? You know, have four running backs lined up out one way and just go pass, pass, pass. I don't know. Harry Plummer. Harry Plummer. No idea. This is your time to shine, mate. Here he goes. And he's got it. Twenty-six all. Oh man, 26 all, 8 seconds to go, Auckland are in position to win it, what's going to happen? Oh. Time's up, oh fuck, they're going to take a drop goal. Oh, he's dropped it! <laughs> Go Canterbury! Go boys! Oh no, he's dropped it again! It's the weather. And we are heading to extra time in the final. Extra time? 26 all after 80 minutes. Great. Oh, now Canterbury's in a position. Come on boys, clinical, this is what you do! Yes! Twisting his way through Tom Sanders scores. Tom Sanders, another name I haven't heard of. Working their way towards the goal post here. Oh man. So it's ten minutes extra time. Auckland are about. It's gonna go to a second extra time. So I've been playing for 90 minutes. You're going to be so tired. Why didn't we see the Auckland try? Sounds like 60,000 here. It does. There goes the siren. Fucker, fucker grabs it. We didn't even see how they won. All we just saw is at, thir at, at 33 all. And now it's 40-33. Okay. You tell me how that works. What an anti-climax. <laughs> oh, well. Good on you, Auckland. You deserve to win. The next video we're going to watch is another, another rugby one. 
We're going to watch the other game that was uh, played over the weekend that I really wanted to see, which is New Zealand versus Australia for the third match of three, which is actually played in Japan, believe it or not, over the weekend. So we're going to talk about that in the next video. I won't go on. This has been enough. Auckland, well done. The 2018... Oh, it's not even ITM. It's called Mitre 10 Cup. <laughs> it's not the ITM Cup anymore. It's the Mitre 10 Cup which is another sponsor, but it's a very similar sort of store. Hardware, timber, garden stuff, you know. Anyways guys, if you have liked this video, please press like. If you want to subscribe, please do. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.